In today's video, I'm going to be breaking down a universal blitzing concept that you can use from Nickel245 and Madden21. Guys, if you've never been to my YouTube channel before, my YouTube channel posts four videos a day that help you with some type of tactic, tangible tip or trick that you can use to get better at this game. And what we're doing today is we're talking Nickel 245. And so if you want to stay up to date whenever we post a new video, or if you want to catch our live streams when we live stream uh, right here on YouTube, we typically stream every single night, um, you can go ahead and click subscribe at the bottom right and you can turn on the notifications and that's going to help you know whenever we post new video. All right, nickel two, four, five. So what we're going to do is we're going to come out and cover two or Tampa two. It doesn't really matter. And all we're going to do is we're going to base a line. We're going to press coverage. We're going to pinch our linebackers. And then from there, we're going to blitz this linebacker here, KJ right. And we're going to blitz this corner on this left side. And then I like to just QB um, or crash my line down. And you see here, it's a very, very simple uh, blitz. We're going to zone drop off our backside guy. And what you're going to see here is you're typically going to get some type of either edge or gap pressure uh, from this very, very simple defense. So again, pinch your line, pinch your line, I'm sorry, not pinch your line, uh, pinch your linebackers, crash your line down. You're going to blitz that left of screen blitzing corner. You're going to blitz that left of screen linebacker, and then you're going to just drop that defensive end on the right into a zone. And you're going to see here, this is very simple. Sometimes you'll get that disengage A gap pressure, as you see right there. That's actually what I typically will get in head to head games. Um, but anyways, guys, just wanted to share this with you. These swap exchange blitzing concepts, in my opinion, are the best way to get pressure in Madden 21 right now. So go ahead and check this out. There we do get picked up. Sometimes with practice mode, it's a little finicky when you run the same blitz over and over again. But there's so much you can do from the nickel 245 this year. It's one of the better defenses uh, in Madden. Uh, and you'll see here just a simple pressure setup or not that left edge. And you're going to oftentimes get that uh, disengage a gap pressure. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you haven't already yet, guys, make sure to join my Discord. My Discord is the best possible place for you to um, for you to uh, be a part of our community and just share and network and also be, be able to share your advice and your tips and your strategies and all that fun stuff. So if you haven't already, make sure to jump in the Discord. A link is in the description below. We've got a couple more videos coming for you today on the YouTube channel. So make sure you subscribe and stay posted. And also if you have Madden 21 questions, you can always text me. My cell phone number is 812-216-3644. We'll see you guys later this afternoon.